super talented guy. He's going to continue to get better. He's a good player. He has an excellent game. Welcome to a special edition of Toyota Sports Sunday. I'm Jeff Gravely along with Chris Miller. And tonight, we will devote our entire show to high school phenom LeBron James of Akron, St. Vincent St. Mary's. What better way to cap St. Patty's Day than a look at the Irish's top player? That's right. We've spent the last six months following James. And our goal in the next 30 minutes is to show you more than the excellence on the basketball court. And what a journey it's been. You know, this summer, uh, it was basketball and more basketball. Then, a surprising decision to play football. For LeBron James, it was a summer of full-blown basketball. Camps and tournaments in Las Vegas, California, and New Jersey. Maybe out of the whole three months of the summertime, probably spent maybe two weeks at home. LeBron's summer hoops journey took him to Chicago twice to work out with NBA stars like Jerry Stackhouse, Penny and Tim Hardaway, Antoine Walker, and a man LeBron James idolizes, Michael Jordan. The first visit when he came home, he was in awe because that's his man. That is his man. And he was more like, Mom, you are not going to believe who I met, the king of basketball. <laughs> and I'm like, Michael Jordan? He was like, yeah. So he was really excited. I mean, that's a dream come true for me. That's the first time you know. That, that's the first time, you know. Um, it, was, it was so shocking that that I just, I mean, when I first seen him, he didn't even look real, you know? But with each visit, LeBron became more and more comfortable around Jordan. First time it was me and Michael Jordan, now it's me and Mike. Be like Mike, play like Mike, succeed like Mike. That's the vision of LeBron James. That's my long time goal. I want to get to the NBA, you know? Um, if it's not two years, three years, six years, I want to get there sooner or later. And um, I'm going to get there. I, um, it don't matter, just a matter of time, I'm going to get there. Basketball is LeBron's future. That's why it was such an odd sight in September to see the country's best high school basketball player standing tall among the Fighting Irish football team. He originally was going to skip his junior year of football, but could not bear to watch. LeBron was going to play football, and the risk of injury didn't matter. The first week when they played Garfield, and I was in the stands, I, I really missed them. I missed them a lot, and I missed being out there on the field helping my teammates. And um, that's what I miss most about it, man. Me just having fun. Initially, though, that decision didn't get full support from his mother, Gloria. I said no. <laughs> I said no. I was worried. I didn't want him, him to be injured behind cheap shots, you know. Um, but then I had to think about it and remember that he's 16, he's still a kid, and he, want, he wants to play, and he enjoys playing. Actually, when he was growing up, LeBron was very good at football, you know, watching football games and uh, seeing how he run touchdowns back. LeBron still holds Akron's peewee record for touchdown, but he's no slouch in pads today either. Twice an all-state wideout with 15 touchdowns and 1,100 yards receiving this year. Um, I think me playing football makes me more hungry for basketball. But football also held up his start to formal basketball practice. As the Irish marched to the state semifinals in football, LeBron and several teammates full double duty. After their day in pads, it was off to the gym. So I knew we were going to go far in football, and it, if, if we had played that, if we had played the state championship game, I'd have had to play that morning at 11 o'clock and then that night at 7. So I had to keep my shot in just in case that would have happened, you know. Um, but, you know, we lost the semifinals, so I had that one week of, um, to prepare my shot. And um, just to get back in um, some, you know, getting back in shape. That's what me and the other four guys on the football team did. We had to come in here after football practice and shoot as much as we could before the basketball um, practice was over. That's a pretty tough transition to go yeah. from the physical contact of football to the touch of basketball, too. And Jeff, it really wasn't that much of a transition. I mean, while he was playing football, he was also working on his game. And the interesting thing in that piece that I like is he talked about how in football, if they had went to the state finals, he would have played at 11, they would have played his <laughs> basketball game at 7 o'clock at night. You can only think of like one guy, Roy Jones Jr. did that. That's an amazing feat, especially for somebody that's 17. But he's an athlete that could have done it. Sure could. Hey, when we come back, plenty more of the coming attraction. Just how good is LeBron James? We'll define his game with some help from the best to ever lace him up.
Sports Sunday, sponsored by your Northern Ohio Toyota dealers. Get the feeling, Toyota. What's so good about Toyota's nationwide spring event? How about incredible values on a huge selection? With 18 models to choose from, there's one just for you. Now, for five days only, look for this coupon. Make your best deal, then get an extra $500 off all these cars, all these SUVs, or all these trucks. That's 10 models, five days, $500 off. That's in addition to all factory incentives. Look for the coupon in your paper and see your Northern Ohio Toyota dealer before it all ends Monday. I'm here at Stiles Pick and Pack to see if anyone can actually play an Ohio Lottery instant game in an instant. Yeah. Oh, that's very good. Now, so far, it has the best time, 1.3 seconds. Not good enough. Want to be where the action is? Play Vegas Action, our new $12 instant ticket. Win up to $2.5 million instantly. You can even win up to 20 times. The almost instant games from the Ohio Lottery. Good luck. Please. <laughs> like playing around with stuff? Well, at Best Buy, you can play around with anything you want. Actually, that's half the fun. Best Buy, go ahead, turn on the fun. The time is right. Your window of opportunity is here for two great leases on Lincoln Luxury and Performance. Road and Track Magazine said we can enthusiastically recommend the Lincoln LS, the sports sedan born in the USA. Lease LS for $4.99 a month or Lincoln Navigator for $6.49 a month with no down payment, no security deposit, no first month payment, and no cash to its sign. Plus, every Lincoln comes with complimentary maintenance. See your Lincoln dealer today. Is LeBron James the best high school player you've ever seen? For sure, he's got to be in your top five. You know, I had a chance to cover Tracy McGrady in North Carolina when he was a senior in high school, and LeBron right now as a junior is better than McGrady wow. was as a senior in high school. Tracy's not that bad of a player Not a right bad now. ball player either. You know, Jeff, LeBron makes you conjure up thoughts of some of the best ever, not to compare but to make reference to. In fact, LeBron has done something not many high school kids can do, bring out NBA superstars to watch him play. Number one players must stick together. I know who he was. I saw the sports of the trade. I talked to a few people about him. He's a good player. From those words to what you see on the court, LeBron James is a complete player. At 6'7", can do a multitude of things off the dribble, creating his own shot. But can dish the rock when doubled and even triple teams. Also, his vision to pass to open guys is excellent. Defensively, can guard an opposing team's best player regardless of size, speed, or position. Not something you see in high school, rarely seen in college, but a must to make it to the NBA. He has an excellent game at this level. He probably could do some damage on the next level, too. That's what I worked hard for, is to get a national spotlight. You know, staying after practice every day with me and my teammates. You know, them helping me get better, me helping them get better. And um, that's what I want, you know. I want our team to get national publicity just as well as I am. A unique gift to play basketball given to LeBron doesn't mean his work ethic can slip. Even after winning his second consecutive state basketball title, LeBron told his father, Eddie, it was time to get back to work. Last year, at the end of the state championship, you know, he just got finished winning the state championship. He uh, just got finished doing the uh, press conference. And at the, end of the, at the end of the day, he looked at me, he said, Pops, everybody think that I'm done. I'm going to get right back into the gym and work hard because I got to do them again next year. I mean, even this summer, he and I will go to the gym. We shoot 800 to 1,000 jumpers a day. A day. And contrary to popular belief, great players can make great teammates. LeBron, at times during a game, can take over, but decides to get his teammates involved. Drew Joyce Jr. has been a friend of LeBron since the fifth grade. He tries to get everybody in the court involved. He hitting, even if you're doing bad, he's still going to try and get you the ball in some sort of way. If that sounds familiar, LeBron's idol, Michael Jordan, too, carries the same leadership banner. And this summer, shared the court and advice with the coming attraction. Very talented guy, and um, I think he's uh, 
you know, he's going to continue to get better at, the, at that young age. I've seen him play. He's, he's very talented. Obviously, I think he, he, he feels he's still got some learning. He, he does have some learning to go through, but the potential is there. And, you know, that's something to keep the motivation, keep the fire burning. And if he continues to work hard, and you know, he can very well end up on this level. I don't know how quick he's planning on doing that, but, you know, from what I've seen, he's a very talented player. LeBron's second favorite player is Kobe Bryant, another high school phenom during his days in Philly understands what James is going through since he's been there making that leap straight to the NBA. Ultimately, what it comes down to is the belief in yourself. And you have to support yourself. You have to have confidence in yourself and you have to have the work ethic uh, that instills the confidence in yourself. And, uh, and if he has that, he'll be fine. You know, I can talk to him until he's blue in the face. His mom can talk to him until he's she's blue in the face about X, Y, Z. But it only sounds better when it comes from Mike and from Walker. Paul Pierce, uh, Allen Iverson, whoever, Shaquille O'Neal. It only sounds better when it comes from the people that have been there. And the true sign of LeBron's greatness as of late is the play of Romeo Travis, who in the last two games is averaging 32 points. Because of all the attention LeBron receives from opposing coaches, Jeff, it's just crazy to see Jordan, Shaq, and Kobe <laughs> talking about a 17-year-old and how good he is. Exactly. You know, you brought up a good point about Romeo. LeBron enjoys getting other people the basketball. It's not like you see LeBron going out and taking 30 shots a night. This guy is a complete basketball player, and really it doesn't take a super talent evaluator to see that LeBron James has a special skill on the floor. So good, he would have been drafted in the top five last year, could be the top pick in this year's draft. Is the NBA his next stop, or is it college basketball? We were graciously given access to the James household to introduce a side of LeBron that few have seen to get more insight into the decision of his future. Just about everyone in these Akron apartments knows there is an extremely popular tenant who lives here. A bulletin board in the entrance keeps the residents caught up on the latest news about LeBron James. But there is one problem. The mailbox can't hold all of the college letters sent to the nation's top recruit. We only have a small mailbox, for one. But LeBron receives anywhere from... 10 to 15 letters a day, okay. still from colleges. So um, they won't fit in the mailbox. So the mailman has to bring them personally up to my apartment. Which is six flights up. Six flights up. And once the hand-delivered mail reaches its destination six floors up, LeBron reads it all. Each college making their pitch to join their program. And from the words of persuasion, James has whittled down the list to five college candidates. You got um, Ohio State, Florida, North Carolina, of course Duke, Louisville, and my five. But James isn't just being recruited by universities. LeBron may opt for the NBA when he finishes high school. Somebody might laugh at these colleges sending you all these letters, saying they're wasting their time. Uh -huh. Do you agree with that? Or? Oh, no, not at all. Maybe I only some of the ones I agree with is probably, you no know, low schools. You know, um... Schools I never heard of. You know, you can laugh at them, but not major colleges. You know, because um, I am thinking about going to college now. You know, because the college game is fun. You know, you just you're not out there playing for money. You're not out there playing for the crowd. You're out there playing for your out there playing for your teammates, and you playing for your you know you playing for the community that you have. And um, it's all passion. They all want to win. Basketball has its starting five, and it's ironic that LeBron quantifies in fives from the list of five schools to a room filled with pictures of his five favorite players in the NBA. Oh yeah, my number one player is standing right over here. This is my number one player. Michael Jordan, um, the reason why, you know, his determination is great. You know, he does, he does a lot of things on the court. You know, um, I think the leadership he has is just like mine. Well, the way I have it is just like his, you know, he gets his teammates into the game. No one would ever think that he can turn around the Wizards like they are now. And um, he made Popeye Jones into an all-star on their team. You know, just like that. The back of the door, Kobe. That's my second favorite player. The reason why is, you know, he came straight out of high school. And he has a great determination. He has a lot in common with Jordan. And he just does a lot of things on the court to help his teammates. My third is um, the biggest heart in the NBA. You know, for a little guy to be that little, six foot, and be able to score over <laughs> seven two, you know, score over six eleven. Clay Hurt. Clay Hurt, elbow, is great. You know, I love Allen Iverson. My fourth favorite player 
is by the name of Tracy McGrady. For him to be 6'9 um, and put the ball on the ground and post up and shoot threes is great. That's my fifth favorite player in the NBA, but that's my best friend in the NBA. Really? You know, um, me and Antoine Walker do talk on the phone. You know, and um, I got a pretty good relationship with him, and he, and he's a good, he's a good guy. You know, not just on the court, but off the court. And that's my top five. A lot of players on my wall have met that poster right there, my Adidas poster. You know, they sent it to me, and the all the players who was with Adidas, you know, went to the NBA, and um, you know, maybe someday it might be me. You know, we have the CD in. So it's a question mark, and it got my face on it. Maybe someday it might be me with Adidas. You know, as of right now, you don't know. Kobe gave me these shoes, handed them to me Saturday before the Oak Hill game, and asked me if I wanted, if I would wear them. And, you know, I said, yeah. You know, I, he won the first game of the season, and I thought they were so great. I looked at them at first like, what are those? And then, you know, they called them the flag shoes. And um, I won the Oak Hill game, and it gave me a lot of success. Which shoes to wear? Which university to visit? Whether to test the NBA after high school? These are the questions that 17-year-old LeBron James will have to answer. And the sky is the limit. His mom was telling me that he makes decisions at the last minute. And I asked LeBron about that. And I said, why do you do that? And he said, because I want to gather all the information to make the best decision. And not a knee-jerk decision, but what a decision he has to face. That's tough. you got $20 million in the shoot contract, potentially. But you could also play in front of, you know, 20000 You had a chance to see him last week. And the question I asked you upstairs was, what was the environment like at Gondarina to see all these people either rooting for you or against you still? 20,000 people watching you perform. It was a college atmosphere, and it excited LeBron. He loves the attention and the attraction that a game like that brings. So, you know, maybe I'm an idiot, but I do think the attraction of playing on the Final Four, playing in a college environment, is enticing to him. So, NBA possibility, college possibility, and those who think they have decided, uh-uh, because he hadn't decided. You said you wouldn't be surprised if he did either. Either way, 50-50, nothing will surprise me. Hey, now's the time. Go ahead and get that refill. you got about a <laughs> buck and a half to do so. Then it's back for more of the coming attraction. Family and a tight circle of friends. They are the backbone of LeBron James, but there are plenty of people trying to get a piece of this high school junior. Big news, Ford buyers. The biggest auto show in America is going on right now at Mullinax Ford. Right now, get special $2,500 factory rebates on Tauruses, F-Series, Rangers, Explorer Sports, and Windstars. But what good is a big rebate if you can't find the Ford you want? Mullinax has over 3,000 new Fords on sale with special auto show prices posted. See the new Fords at the auto show, but you'll want to buy them at Mullinax Ford in Amherst, Wycliffe, and North Canton. March 22nd, their fraternity will force them to join a sorority. Yeah, very funny. Oh, my God. Why? <laughs> I love when you braid my hair. Tell us about yourself. I'm addicted to porn. Um, Hello, bye. Uh, Sorority Boys, rated R. Please be a size eight. Oh, yeah! Starts March 22nd. Last night, I dreamed I was at the Cleveland Auto Show. At the Chevy display. New cars, future cars. What could be better than this? How about 2,502 in consumer cash or zero APR on Cavalier? In addition to other great deals on the full line of Chevy cars and trucks. You heard right. 2,502 in consumer cash or zero APR on Cavalier. There's only one way to turn your dreams into reality. Get to your Chevy network dealer today. The timeout really worked. We'll let you know Monday on Good Morning Cleveland. Hey, when we were 17, it was like, do I have the car for the weekend and can I get it, some gas in it, you know? And some gas money. And some big gas money. You know, how does a 17-year-old handle all of the national attention and adoration that LeBron James is getting? It takes a pretty heady person with a strong support group. LeBron James has a tight circle of family and friends who will help him navigate his way to decision day. If you've been there through thick and thin, you're in the circle. If you're just now trying to join the show, too late. Gloria James had LeBron when she was 17 years old and raised him in a single-parent home. Even though LeBron has never met his biological father, he has a dad. Eddie Jackson has been a part of the James family since LeBron was eight months old. You know, I got my dad. You know, he's not, everyone knows he's not my biological father, but, you know, I call him my dad. And, um, the, you know, when he was there, 
he was great. You know, he had some um, problems, but you know, he made up for it. And God gives you another chance, and he gave him another chance, and he's making, he's doing real well now. And he's been there for me and my mother, you know, when we was going through hard times. It's that biological son that I've never had. You know what I mean? So when people ask me that your son is, yeah, he, I, that's my son. I don't get hung up in the surrogate, the uh, step, and all and that. It's my son. Period. Eddie and Gloria are the ones who are deciphering the future of their basketball star. And there are plenty of business opportunities already being discussed. A shoe battle between Nike and Adidas could pay LeBron $20 million. 20 more mil if he is the first pick in the NBA draft. I, myself, and his dad, Eddie, have been in contact with marketing firms. Uh, a couple of agents that are interested in representing LeBron. The shoe company, Sonny Picaro. We were fortunate to meet Phil Knight. And from my understanding, he don't meet a whole bunch of folks. And he expressed deep interest in LeBron. Once myself and Gloria talk to whoever it is we talk to, then we come back letting know everything. We don't, hide, we don't hide anything from them. Because the thing is, what we want to do is teach them. You know, because eventually, it's all about him. Business talk isn't the only thing going around. This summer, a story circulated that LeBron would opt for the pros as a high school junior, but NBA rules won't allow it. And for the record, I might add, it was never our intention to even battle that ruling. Never before has this even been an issue. I can't think of any other high school player uh, that's had the scrutiny that he's had at this early of an age. I mean, Kobe Bryant had it some, but not to this level. Uh, so this is, uh, we're, we're all treading on new ground here. This is new territory. But it's the old territory that is comforting to LeBron James, and this high school junior wants to become a senior. You know, you can't get back things like prom your senior year. You know, graduating with your class in 2003, senior night. You know, just being able, being able to walk down the hall and just know I'm a senior. LeBron isn't ready to break up the Fab Four. He, along with Drew Joyce III, Sheon Cotton, and Willie McGee, have grown up together and competed together. These are the guys that James shares his basketball dreams with. He's been talking about it since about fifth grade. That's, his, that's been his goal in life to make it to that, to that highest level. He'd always believed that he was special or that he was, you know what I mean, cream of the crop because, as you can see, he is, but it hasn't changed him at all. I mean, some people who really don't even know him are always trying to say that he's cocky or whatever, but that's not the case whatsoever. Friends don't see a different LeBron, but they do recognize his surroundings have sure changed from a make-believe magazine cover to the chosen one on Sports Illustrated. As the word spreads about this talented 17-year-old, Hands are reaching in from everywhere. You know there's people out there. There's groupies out there. There's agents out there. There's, you know, there's people out there just always trying to get a piece of the best player. You know, they really don't know who you are as a person. They just know who you are as a basketball player. But, um, you know, I, know, I don't let them get to me at all. You know, it's kind of like a, it's, I feel like I got a shield around me. And they really can't touch me. But, you know, the only people that really can touch me is the people that had the keys. And they know who they are. And they are the ones who will help LeBron James weigh his many options. But he is the one who will make the final decision. I think you see that strong support group there and you understand how he's going to make this decision and the proper channels he's going through. Jeff, it's very important someone as young as LeBron is to have that support system. A lot of players fall through the cracks and get bad advice. LeBron James has circled himself around people that have given him nothing but positive energy. Well, just LeBron and the Irish have made it to the Final Four in D2 hoops. It's a drive for a three-peat next weekend in Columbus. St. V's won their regional title last night, and there's more room in the trophy case. Sports Sunday, sponsored by your Northern Ohio Toyota dealers. Get the feeling, Toyota. What's so good about Toyota's nationwide spring event? How about incredible values on a huge selection? With 18 models to choose from, there's one just for you. Now, for five days only, look for this coupon. Make your best deal, then get an extra $500 off all these cars, all these SUVs, or all these trucks. That's 10 models, 5 days, $500 off. That's in addition to all factory incentives. Look for the coupon in your paper and see your Northern Ohio Toyota dealer before it all ends Monday.
We've got a lot of positive change going on. The change at Huntington over the last year has been incredible. We're refocusing. Getting back to basics, taking care of the customer. Start a new direction. If you are an agent of change, that is welcome. Change is um, opportunity. And change uh, and the positive effects of change are infectious. That's really important to see from leadership. There's a lot more smiles. That's a plus. It's a positive growth mentality. This is what I'm talking about. I'm Dan Klimas, the regional president, and we're building a brand new Huntington. Make Saturday evenings a night at the movies in the comfort of your home. Saturdays at 8, only on News Channel 5. Brought to you by your Lincoln Mercury dealers. The new 255 horsepower Infiniti i35 with the most powerful engine in its class. Don't blink. More power, more grace, more eye. The new I-35 from Infinity. Now, as for St. V's, the team, their quest for a three-peat is still intact. In fact, if successful, they'll join only two other schools in the 80-year history of the Ohio State Tournament. Ottawa Glandorf was the latest to fall. 77-58, Coach Drew Joyce received the total team effort. Three players in double figures led by Romeo Travis with 31. LeBron stayed true to form, supplying a complete performance. 21 points, 16 rebounds, one assist shy of the triple-double. And now with a post-presence, Coach Drew Joyce challenges other coaches. Pick your poison. LeBron and the boys, state semifinals against Poland Seminary, Thursday at 2. We'll see you there. Sports Sunday, sponsored by your Northern Ohio Toyota dealers. Get the feeling, Toyota. What's so good about Toyota's nationwide spring event? About incredible values on a huge selection. With 18 models to choose from, there's one just for you. Now, for five days only, look for this coupon. Make your best deal. Then get an extra $500 off all these cars, all these SUVs, or all these trucks. That's 10 models, 5 days, $500 off. That's in addition to all factory incentives. Look for the coupon in your paper and see your Northern Ohio Toyota dealer before it all ends Monday. A simple solution to keep your kids healthy, Monday at 5. No one knows exactly how man discovered fire. Whether it was lightning hitting a tree, or rubbing two sticks together. But we do know that 10 minutes later, he discovered meat. The new menu at Damon's. That's hot, baby. The grill is on. Say, Ed, mind if I uh, borrow the ram? Sure. Going out with your buddy? <laughs> Hauling a stack of 4x8 drywall? <laughs> Towing a gravel crusher? Yeah, no, actually, I just need to pick up this, like, antique sewing table. Four full-size doors and a full-size bed. The all-new Dodge Ram. Grab Dodge's 7 100 powertrain pledge plus an additional $500 auto show cash allowance. Well, after a look at the coming attraction, I want to thank Gloria James, mother of LeBron, for her access accessibility, and also Eddie Jackson and C-Mill, Jeff Gravely. We're out of here.